we are proposing a new idea for Community Supported Agriculture or CSA for short. And this is an idea that came out from US, Europe and uh, Japan where the consumer uh, became concerned with what they are eating. They don't know who is growing their food or what goes into producing their food. So the consumer got together uh, and formed consumer groups, approached the farm directly and tell the farm that we are prepared to buy your produce if you were to give us safe and organic food. You know? So they come up with that uh, advance payment for a share in the harvest for the next three months or six months. You know? And then together with the farmer, they work, work out how much that share of the harvest would be. Okay, so in the West, they give the money to the farmer and then every week, the farmer delivers a bag of food at a, a great quantity and variety and the consumer just pick it up uh, their bag of the harvest, the share of the food. Now, over here, we have an issue of trust. Now, can we trust the farmer? We are giving you the money, will you grow for us? And also the farmer, can, can the farmer trust you that you will buy his produce? You know? So, uh, Joho Green is a consumer group that is formed to address this issue of trust. Joho Green is consumer, are the consumer themselves. You know, coming together to hold the money in trust. So that each week when the farmer delivers the bag of food, uh, vegetable and uh, fruits, he gets paid by the committee, the consumer committee. So in this way, uh, we have a win-win situation. You know, the farmer is assured of a market and know who is selling to. The consumer knows who is buying from and what goes into producing the food. So this is called CSA, Community Supported Agriculture. Upside 所以你來打包是很適合<笑> 250 million years old. This is a system. Doesn't mean that our jungle is that old. The system is that old. For the system to be that old, we belong to one of the 12 mega biodiversity of the world, meaning that Malaysia is one country very rich biodiversity, starting from reptiles, to the plants, to the birds, to the fish, meaning that there are still lots of things to be studied and researched, and even the uh, name in Malaysia alone. Insects alone, uh, the, uh, the scientists say close to 10 million of insects are still not studied. In this world, we exploit the environment and we become rich. But we forgot to give back to the environment. So this awareness is practically zero. So now is the time. Join us. Join the society. Because we have special interest group. Every state has a branch. And every state, the branches, we set up all these different groups so that if you're interested in bird, you join a birding group. If you're interested in diving, you join a diving group. Or you're a mountain climber, very athletic, you can climb the mountain or you join the bicycling group, so on and so forth. Meaning that nobody is left out. So now, we want to focus on school children so that the young mind, they can learn fast and quick 
about their own environment and from there they grow with it. I grew up in the environment as a kid. <coughs> that is why I am so passionate about it. If you ask me where is safer, I would say the jungle is safest place on earth. Simple reason is we don't have slash teeth, we don't have accidents, we don't have pollutants, we don't have poisons. We have ever friendly living things in the forest. It is because of a misunderstanding. We think that the, the tiger be waiting for you. No. They avoid us. They live in their world. We don't understand them. We get all kinds of crooked ideas about the forest. Join MNS, then you find out. It is a totally different world. It is like open air university where there is so much you can never finish learning.